G Suite extension called Message Sender for WhatsApp. It is built by Wattie.io and it can be used to send broadcast template notification to multiple users uh, using G Suite and it makes use of WhatsApp's official business APIs. So first thing you have to go to go to Google Sheets, click on Add-ons and then click on Get Add-ons. Once you do that, you will be able to open the G Suite marketplace where you will be able to find a lot of add-ons. Over here you have to search for Message Sender for WhatsApp. So this is the add-on that we have. Click on install add-on. Click on continue. It's asking for some permissions because we need access to uh, manage Google Sheets on your behalf. We allow all the permissions. So it's setting up the extension for you. Once you are done setting up the extension, we can close this. Over here you'll be able to find message sender for WhatsApp and you can click on WhatsApp schedule. It will load a pop-up. So first thing that you have to do is to select the phone numbers along with the country code. So select all the phone numbers that you have in the Google Sheet that you want to send the message to. Once you select that, you click on OK. You load the phone numbers. After that, you go to setting. Under settings, you'll have to set the endpoint, which you'll be able to find on your Wati dashboard. This is the API endpoint that you have to copy. You copy it here. The access token you copy from here, and then you paste it here. Once you do that, you can test your connection just to make sure that everything is fine then you tested it successful you save it click on next once you click on next it will load the list of templates that you have on your account so you click on the templates that you want to send to then there's a variable that you want to uh, populate so variable you can select the rows that have the variable the fields basically that have the variable then you click on next this is a preview of all the messages that will be sent and then you can send them messages so by making use of whatsapp's official apis you'll be able to send these messages now you click on view details once you do that you can already see that the broadcast has been created and it has already sent the message to it has been delivered to two numbers thank you